Genevieve over at Bergstrom Lexus in Appleton. I just thought I would make a quick walk around video for you on the 2014 ES300H we were talking about. So here you go. The car was redesigned to this body style in 2013. Um, a big change that they made to the car was the front grille. And then the car now has this LED wrapped lighting around the front headlights. This vehicle has 18 inch wheels. The color of this is the nebula gray pearl. You can see here in the rear of the car that it's got the spoiler and it also has LEDs in the taillights. On the inside of the car, like I said before, it's a black leather interior. Over here on the door panel, it has wood trim, bamboo wood trim, memory seating, power windows, door locks. Another instrument panel here that controls your side view mirrors. Blind spot monitor is what BSM stands for. That is little lights here in your side view mirrors that will light up a bright orange when somebody's in the blind spot of your vehicle. Um, the other button that's right next to it is for parking sensors. Those are sensors on the front and rear bumper of the car that beep at you when you get too close to things. On the steering wheel, radio controls on the left hand side, audio controls on the right hand side, your instrument panel. This vehicle is equipped with the navigation system. That is what this mouse is for right here. You adjust everything with the um, navigation system with this mouse. All the display comes up inside of here, um, deep inside this little cave. And it's actually um, kind of far in here so that it always stays dark and well lit for you to be able to see it while you're driving. You can see the wood trim expands around the vehicle, also over to the other door. Analog clock. CD changer, radio controls, climate controls. You have dual climate controls um, with different temperatures on either side of the car. Heated seats and air conditioned seats. This car also has a heated steering wheel. It also has a power sunshade. And that will go down automatically when you put the car in reverse or you can push the button to put it down on your own. An adjustable transmission for the car that lets the car, even though it's a hybrid and has one continuous gear, it does allow you options of how you want to drive the car. If you put it in an eco mode, that actually makes the car drive in a way that's going to get the best fuel efficiency. If you put it in a sport mode, that's actually kind of the opposite of eco. It's going to let you burn fuel, but it's also going to let the car have a little bit more pickup and acceleration. And you can push the button right back down and go into normal and back into the normal mode. Um, here is the shifter right here, right next to the navigation mouse cup holder here and there the cup holders are split up in this car one cup holder here another cup holder right here so you won't have things banging together storage compartment moonroof homelink controls oh, you can't really see them but homelink controls that you can program your garage door openers um, right into buttons right here on the on the rear view mirror and moonroof controls and Safety Connect for Lexus, which is like having a 911 button in the car. We didn't even go in at all into the navigation system. There's tons of stuff inside of there, but um, we're get, I'm getting a little bit ahead of myself as far as all that stuff goes, but I just wanted to give you a really good idea of kind of what's in this car and um, what we've been talking about all this time. So if you've got some questions, give me a call. I really hope that this is your next vehicle. Talk to you later.